ribs, tenders, and dinghies, guys. Alfred Montana here at Annapolis Butt Show. I wanted to do a dedicated walkthrough of some of the rib boats that were here in Annapolis. And right now we're here uh, where Highfield has their booth. So definitely want to show you guys some of the ones that are here. Let's go ahead. These guys are trying to sell a boat. Let me get, oh no, they're getting into the video, folks. All right, let's go here. Let's front run them. We got a big boy here. All these are aluminum, guys. Highfield is aluminum hulls. So um, I, I'm a fan of aluminum ribs. I really am. Look at this. Look at all the space in here with the way that that uh, helm is. I like that, right? Don't you? Isn't that super cool? I like this. It's got a Tahatsu engine. And uh, is this a soft bottom? Yes, it's soft bottom here, guys. Look at this. An RU320 soft bottom. So it literally rolls up and you put it in the back of your truck. Or your car, or your trunk, or in your balcony at home, right? See that? That's cool. I did a huge series on my channel called the Dinghy Series. Um, look at Zodiac. Zodiac. All right. Zodiac. Okay. Zodiac has a monster boat over here. The X10CC. That's what it's called. I had to think about it, guys. Look at this. What's this? Nomad. 3.3 RIB. Ooh, I like this. Look how big this locker is, dude. Dude. Hard bottom aluminum. I'm liking this. Guys, anytime you have storage, it's nice. On a little rib like this, those little lockers are always nice. Is this is this weather sealed? Let me see. Hold on. Okay. It's Interesting. It's a Hypalon tube. Hmm. Zodiac for the win. Wait for it. Oh, there he is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is. What's going there on, Mike? Hey, I learned how to turn on the boat. It's this whole battery button on the console. <laughs> well, the, now you just. <laughs> New boat problems. Yeah. Uh, had that thing two weeks, dude. Listen, but they're, they're going to see that video. video. Wasn't it badass? Dude, aren't Grady White badass? They're very good boats. They're the best. That's why I love selling them. Yes, I'm actually doing a video right now of all the rib boats here at the show. Oh, yeah, you love the ribs. I love ribs. So, so yes, you're talking about the full walkthrough video that I did. Yeah, yeah. That I refer, I'm going to tell them to watch, too, because that was the whole show. Sure. And we were on the 386 Canyon. Yeah, yeah that's what we just got. Yeah, and did you sell it? What's that? Not yet. Not, not yet. It's no, going. We got a couple people on it, but we'll see how it goes, dude. <laughs> good to see you. I'm about to, I'm about to oh, leave the show. You, yes, guys. Yeah. You want a drink? No, I'm good. Thanks, Mike. No, I'm good. I just finished having. Crush. I just not. <laughs> Wait for it. No, 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 I'm good. Thank you. <laughs> Mike always comes through over here in Annapolis, guys. It's many years, guys. Many years we've been doing this. Okay. Back to Highfield. Back to Zodiac. And we have some other boats over here. Wow, there's a lot of boats here. Highfield's had a bunch of boats. All right, let me get to these first, because I see a lot more back there. Okay, Medline, super popular model for Zodiac. What do you guys think? Look at this. Now, wait until you guys see that sea trial that I did with the CX-10. The X. 10 cc it's crazy okay look this is this is a soft inflatable bottom but it actually it has actually these boards that you put inside of them and it's got a mercury aviator 7.5 oof thingy series See, what I like doing about the Dingy Series is to show you guys that you can just get on anything. Now, I, I also came from Genova, and I showed a lot of big rib boats. 
A lot of big rib boats in Genova. Black tubes here, Hyperlon. Um, you know how I can tell it's my uh, Hyperlon? See this right here? I, I, I recommend Hyperlon, guys, uh, as opposed to PVC. That's just a preference thing of mine, especially because I'm in uh, a lot harder climates, right? All right, um, let's go see what's going on here. Okay, we got we got Walker Bay and more Highfields. Generation Walker Bay, guys. Comment below. Look at all the space on this tender, guys. This is literally a tender. I mean, it could be used as a boat, right? Behind your house, go grab a couple of drinks, cup, grab a couple of things. And here is another Walker Bay. Okay, I like the Venture a lot, right? Because it has rod holders. Oh, this one doesn't have rod holders. Why doesn't this have rod holders? Oh, I guess they didn't ask for, for, for rod holders. Okay. They, they can put rod holders on them, guys. And they have a ski bar also that you put on them. Nice looking boats. And then we got more rib boats here. East Marine boats. Another aluminum hull. A lot of aluminum boats. What's the price point on something like this? Imagine that, the end cones literally have a step up, which is wild. Same thing here. Got some little Tahatsus. Let's see what's up with the smaller. This, um, guys, this is perfect for your boat. You literally put this on a davit. You have it on the boat. You take it off the boat. How's you it tow going? it. How's it going? What's going on? This is East Marine Boats. Uh, I'm actually located in South Florida, so I'm a little far from home now. But uh, well, welcome home. Thank you. Welcome thank to you. Annapolis home. Yeah. This is my second year. Last year I did 40, 40 sails I made. That's awesome. And the two shows, and the power and the sailboat show. Oh, what's the price point on some of these East uh, Marine? So the thing about East Marine is you're going to factory direct. I don't have any dealers. Okay. So I undercut the market from 30 to 35%. Okay. So, um, this range right here with the 13 footer with a uh, 30 horsepower is 19,500. And it's Hypalon material. You get all the bells and whistles. Rock and that's with an engine. With an engine. How do you get it? So I mean, like, like, like what are you, uh, what, what are you giving them away? No, I'm factory direct. I don't have any dealers, so I'm not marking up anything. I'm my own brand. Okay. I'm my own company. So there you go. I'm located in West Palm Beach, Florida. I'll be at the uh, Fibs. I'll see you there too. Flips, I'm yeah, gonna be there. I'm, I'm taking my studio there. I'll see you there. I'm gonna be paired up with Tahatu. So I'm cool. OEM with Tahatu and Suzuki. So I'll be paired up with them and I'll have a large booth. Um, and these are all aluminum? All aluminum powder coated frames. Uh, Hypalon, Orca, PVC, depending on what you want. So it's Orca Hypalon too? No, so I, I vary. So if you want Orca, I could put Orca. If you want Hypalon, if you want PVC, it's okay. the, up to the customer's choice. Okay, good. And so I'll, I'll significantly affect price too. Yeah, and right? it's, not, it's not much. Good. It's not much. Okay, so let, let me see. What's up with these over here? Yeah, so Come over here because I, I I'm showing all the ribs right now at yeah. the show. Yeah. So these, uh, this is my 300 320 model. Um, this is more of the dinghy style class. Uh, what I do differently on all my tenders is I do the the uh, bow anchor roller. It keeps your line from chafing your material. Very nice. Uh, and then you also get a cleat, so it keeps your line from rubbing up against it. And then you get a keel guard from the bow all the way to the back of the transom. And let me take you to the fun part. Because you want to, you want to go ahead and beach this at the sandbar. That, that's what you want to do. And this is the fun part. 
easier to get on and off the tender these fiberglass end steps. I was just talking about that. Yeah. Like like the end cones, literally you just step on that's 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 smart. For the boat show I throw in a bimini top, you get a boat cover, you get a five year warranty in the boat. Uh, five year warranty, the manufacturer of your choice of engine. Uh, and then I got all the bells and whistles you need. I got courtesy lights, nav lights, you got your portable stern light, you also got an automatic and manual bilge pump. Uh, inside here is how you power this tender up. You got a power switch, you got a fuel water separator, and then we power the audio with uh, Rockford Fosky. How much is something like this? 13,000. 13K. For a 20 horsepower dude i won't eat bk for a month <laughs> and we're good yeah okay so so 13,000. how fast will this little uh tender do a single person you can get up to 30 miles an hour 30 miles an hour yeah, guys. it's aluminum based frame so you don't need a large outboard to push and I, and I like this i like this helm right here this, this is the euro style helm gives you more leg room and then at the bow is a three and a half gallon portable tank this will be all day. You'll be all day with that little oh, tank. Yeah, with yeah. that little uh, toss. 30 nautical miles. It's yeah. a four stroke fuel inject. Uh, and then, you know, like I said, I do a lot of bells and whistles for an affordable price. Uh, right. High blonde material, Orca, PVC, whatever you need, we got it. Here. How can they get in contact with you? Yeah, um, actually, you can contact us at eastmarineboats.com. I also got uh, Instagram. Uh, my name is Anthony. It's a family run business. It's my brother Michael, my dad. What's up, guys? How you doing, Alfred? Doing? Thank you. Hey, I'm, I'm doing just a rib boat video, so, so we, you know how it is. We built, we started the business in 2021. Okay. We built 700 boats and delivered 700 boats in four years. Do you remember interviewing us? In I, did. I, I, I did. I did. I did. I did. I remember. Yeah. I said, Beach boat you're welcome. Nice. <laughs> yeah. That was 700 boats ago. Yes. Yeah. That's customers thank you. Who, of course, us, of course, yeah, of course. Listen, it. listen. Uh, and 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 I, I I like to go ahead and show what's out there. Let you guys, you came up to me. Everybody else has the same chance to come up to me. You guys came up to me. You always come up to me. Yeah, uh -huh. You guys never, never let me go. We, we which love is, the qualified. Yeah, the yes, the chit cho we, and we yes, the chit cho, yeah. Customers yeah. come yeah. to us and say, we saw your boats on, yeah. your, on your channel. Yeah, yes. Well, listen, um, give that information one last time so they can get it. Eastmarineboats.com. You can check us out on Instagram at Godiac Boats. Uh, again, my name is Anthony, my brother Michael. It's nice to see family. Annapolis Boat Show, guys. I'm going to continue with the rib tenders and dinghies. Here, video over here, guys. There you go. Family run business, guys. Walker Bay, again, bigger boats here. I'm trying to see if I find the one that had the rod holders that I remember. Where are my rod holders? I want to go fishing when I'm on a rib. Hold on one second. Hey, bud, can I just get a card? I'll, I'll give you one when I'm done, because I, I don't have it on me right now. Okay. All right, thank you. All right, guys. All right. Um, so Walker Bay, guys. There it is. This is the one. This is the one. This is the one. See, I like this. Rod holders. I guess you can put your... Tow, tow bar there for, for like skiing and stuff. This is the one that I like, right? What do you guys think? A couple seats too. I like this. A little bow locker, storage. They ride nice too. I, I did a couple videos with Rocco Bay. Um, All right, guys. Well, I think I think that I think there might be one or two other in here, but let me let me continue real quick. I'll be right back. All right. What do we got here? Wait for it. What's going on, guys? How are we going? I'm filming all the rib, ribs, tenders, and dinghies here at the show, and we got catamarans. Like a catamaran, rigid, this is rigid or soft inflatable bottom? Fully inflatable. Fully inflatable. Yeah. PVC, Hyperlon, what are they? PVC, what is PVC. Yeah. Okay, so to tell me a little bit about them. Yeah, so um, I can show you. Yeah, show yeah. me. Yeah, show me. I want to see what's up with this. So 
So fully, fully catamaran, flat bottom here. Uh, we make all of our boats out of a PVC fabric called Valmex, which is a German, German. Um, so, 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 so your transom is, is an aluminum piece. Yes, or? aluminum with uh, powder coating all over the top. So, or, or you, uh, you would say aluminium. Uh, uh, aluminium. Yes, uh, correct. That's yes. What, where yeah. are you guys from? I'm from New Zealand. Okay. So the, the company started in New Zealand about nine years ago. Okay. And uh, recently we have since gone to uh, South Flor Florida. Nice. For Auto so, we, so uh, I'm in Miami. You're so, in Miami. So I'm in Miami. Awesome. Awesome. Yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna be also at the at the Fort Lauderdale boat show. Okay. I've seen a couple of these over there, but everybody every time I see these boats out there, there's somebody flying on them like on a five foot <laughs> wave. They're they're just going like yeah. ten feet in the air. Yeah. Is absolutely. that like a sport for you guys or uh, why no. why do they try to kill each other on these? There's there's quite often people that with the same sort of style. It's called Thundercats. Okay. They, they quite often put engines up to 50 horsepower on them oh so our boats are a little bit more versatile we okay. use them for um dinghies tenders yes. fishing uh diving exploring a bit of everything but also our boats are made to be completely portable so they completely pack down yes the the floor comes out packs into its own bag the hull packs down um, how, how, how much would something like this cost? This, this one here is 1900 Okay, so, um, so under 2000 uh, Under 2000 under 2000 yeah. You can go even for a 13 foot boat here. Okay. And you can fit that in the back of your car. I'll probably make that fit in a golf cart after I pack it down. Absolutely, you can. Yeah, you, you get can. a cigar, a golf cart, and you get into... Depending on the yes, the, key, the keys are right there. The keys are there, yes. And listen, all I need is a little six, eight horsepower, and I'm, I don't need to go 100 miles an hour like those crazy folks. <laughs> I just want to go from one place to another so I can smoke my cigar and get away from everybody. <laughs> oh, good on you, yeah, and this is the boat to do it, so... This is pretty cool, and yeah. so the tubes are actually on the water the whole time, right? Exactly. Yeah. So, so that's what's giving you the stability. So, so you have extra stability because of the distance of the tubes. Yeah. So your two biggest points of buoyancy are your two outside tubes yeah. because they're the biggest volume. Yes. Um, so your rock that you traditionally get in a in a standard V hull yeah. boat is not what you experience with these boats. You can stand. I'm not sure if you can see the photo here. Oh no, yes, yes, yes. You can stand on the side of the boat and um, yeah, be, no, no issue at all. Yeah, because it's like a basketball. I mean, like, a bit better quality there. But, um, Where can they go online to get some more information? So you can go straight to truekit, uh, truekit.us or truekit.net. Um, we, like I mentioned at the start, we are based in South Florida, so we ship all over the United States. Call me. Yeah, yes. absolutely. Yes, 786 They'll be calling me all right now. Oh, Pharrell, how are you doing? I love the channel. Um, no, yeah, so yeah, go straight to truekit.us. That's the um, best way to do it. We've got our number. We've got an e email there. Contact me directly. I'm based there. Um, do you miss New Zealand? I Yeah, I do miss New Zealand. It's, it's beautiful, but also... The east coast of the U.S. is, is amazing too. Uh, all right, guys. Oh, yeah. well, listen, check them out over here, Rip Sanders and Dinghies. Look me up, Alpha Thank Montaner you. on 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 YouTube. We're yeah. gonna go ahead and do a sea trial on one of these bad boys. Yeah, absolutely. Let's uh, make it happen. All right, guys. Cheers, mate. Take care, yeah. guys. Just like that. You see that? Yeah. All right. We continue, guys. Let me go look for some more ribs, tenders, and dinghies here at the end of the show.